All right, hey, what's going on, folks? It's Justin Chernell here from onyxdefined.com. Today, I'm going to be talking about how you can set up your PlayStation 4 controller to use as like a super basic drum pad in uh, Fruity Loops. Uh, this is 11. I have 12, but I just don't like the interface. But uh, fucking PlayStation controller. Let me click on the actual program and, you know, just fart around with the drums over here. So what you're going to want to download is this program called Input Mapper. I'll have a link in the description. And it's funny because I took a really fucking long time trying to figure out how to hook up my controller as a MIDI controller. And then I realized uh, you can have the inputs be set as different keys on a keyboard. So basically, I'm just using it to simulate having a keyboard, which you can use in Fruity Loops as a, uh, well, you could use your computer keyboard as a virtual, or like a virtual keyboard. So you just assign the keys to whatever you know, whatever letter on the keyboard will trigger that MIDI sound, and then, you know, that's that. So, then you come back in here and say, okay, when I hit left on my D-pad, it triggers the D5 fucking MIDI note. So, then I go in here, click up here, well, at least this is an FPC, I learn, and then, boom, now I hit left, it's that. So, like, okay, uh, down has no uh, assignment to it, so... We'll go here, assign it, learn, hit down. Now when I hit down, we got a nice little tom right there. So that's basically it. I uh, I don't really have another drum pad program, I don't think, but uh, you know, just for practice, I've been using FBC. So that's uh, that's basically it. So get to uh, get to banging. Ciao.